sound can tell a story. It can create atmosphere. and is often used to breathe life into a world in a way which no other tool can achieve. And yet, sound design in gaming is sometimes an element that is overlooked or entirely unnoticed by the player, and when done right, can be unnoticeable by its very design. But in order to truly value how integral sound can be, we first have to feel what it's like to live without it. And then, with it. My beacon is sure to attract a worthy soul. So sit back and relax as we explore a bunch of the best mods that make up the marvellous world of modded Skyrim. Creatures of Nerd. Men are kings. If he breathes, he is sick. Not because they are easy, but because they are hard. Your sounds in a room, all right? <laughs> Won't hurt. This video is sponsored by Raid Shadow Legends, and Raid have just celebrated their third anniversary as one of the top RPG, mobile and PC games on the market. They've added to their already hundreds of existing characters and bosses with their new innovative designs. They've recently included the Doom Tower, a whole new world of terrifying bosses to slay with over 120 levels for seasoned players to conquer. And of course its newest and biggest addition, the Hydra a multiple-headed monster with new abilities which require new tactics to destroy. But what's new in Raid this month? Well, they've got special events going every single day, including an entire new event for the Summer Solstice called the Path of Life. On top of that, there are some amazing new champions including Deliana, who looks awesome and is one of the strongest support champions in the entire game, who you can acquire through Raid's special Deliana Chase event. All you have to do is log in and play for 7 days between now and July 20th, and you'll get her for free. And for new players, you can enter promo code MYDELIANA to get 50 XP brews to max your legendary Deliana to level 50, as well as a ton of silver. There's seriously never been a better time to get started, and if you use my link or scan the QR code right here, new players will get a free starter pack worth almost $30. We're talking a free champion take realm, 200k silver, 1 XP boost, 1 energy refill, and one Ancient Shard so you can summon an awesome new champion as soon as you get in game. You'll find these rewards here in your inbox for the next 30 days. Thanks to Raid Shadow Legends for supporting the channel, and let's get into the video. The first mod we're going to look at is a big audio pack and is a mod that changes a whole bunch of sound effects in the game, but we're going to start by focusing on just a few regarding the player themselves. Audio Overhaul is a mod which changes a bunch of aspects of sound design in Skyrim. Firstly, there are new Armour Folly sounds. The same goes for Light Armour. And one of the more noticeable changes this mod makes, along with the armour folly sounds, is the footsteps that you're going to be hearing just about 99% of the time, that have all been overhauled for different types of surfaces. But the player's movement is not the only thing this mod alters, as traps have been enhanced too. 
each being given a louder and more deadly tweak. From swing blades to pressure blades, and most noticeably, trip wires, making them slightly more snappy to give you a little more of a fright. Other aspects this mod has altered is the weapon sound effects for, well, pretty much every type of weapon. Keeping them vanilla themed, but just tweaked and enhanced to give them more of a punch and satisfaction while in combat. And overall, I would recommend just giving the mod a go for yourself to experience its changes in full. Next, we're going to go over a sort of mixture of 30 mods, and also one big mod which combines them all, and that's going to be encompassed under the Phoenix Compendium. A mod which combines the best of all the individual sound mods released, and in this segment, we're going to break down each one of its modules to give you a fuller understanding of its changes. And that begins with Air Jetland. Modern Magic Sounds rework, starting with a taste of the Destruction School's new magical sound design. Alteration has also been reworked in order to provide a more world-bending effect with its guttural sound. Which really makes it sound like its spells are truly drawing from some reality-bending powers, like telekinesis for example, which now sounds way more satisfying. And actually, on its own, makes Alteration a whole bunch more fun to cast. But obviously, we're far from done because next we have Restoration, a very valid school of magic, which has new aura-bending sound effects. And even its more offensive spells have been reworked too, in order to provide a sound which actually feels satisfying to cast. Conjuration has arguably been given the biggest change, providing casters with an other-dimensional effect to sell its summoning powers. Overall, really giving the effect of magic formulating to conjure an item or creature, but finally, we have the last of our magic schools, in Illusion, which other than Destruction is the most diverse of the bunch, and arguably the most satisfying. Truly sounding like some mystical arts casting illusions around you. And this covers all spells from Frenzy all the way to illusion spells such as Invisibility. And honestly, this mod on its own is more than enough to justify downloading, but it's not the only aspect of the Phoenix Compendium. One of the big parts of a fun Elder Scrolls game is the creatures and enemies you'll find and fight across your playthrough. And a big part of those creatures and enemies being fun to fight is their sound design. So of course, Phoenix Compendium aims to tackle those as well. <laughs> Along with many of the beasts you just heard there, Changes have also been made to the more fossorial creatures, such as the Thalmer, and this includes everything from their echolocation clicking to even their footsteps, including many different sound utilities to navigate their surroundings. Other creatures include the horrid Hagraven, I've had enough of you. and Atronox now have optional voices. Centurions now sound more intimidating, and most importantly, dragons are reworked to sound more beastly and raw with more malice. And finally, as well as the many living creatures you'll encounter, there are those that are not so alive.
and overall, pretty much every enemy creature in the vanilla game has had some sort of rework to their sound design to make them a more intimidating encounter. And yet we're still not even close to covering all of the Phoenix Compendium, because the last area we're yet to show involves the very NPCs themselves. Now, one thing every Elder Scrolls fan will notice is when an NPC has a unique voice actor, as there are quite a few repeats. So what this section aims to do is rework some of the unique NPC's voice files in order to make them stand out more clearly. So we'll start with the humanoids. First is the endgame level Ebony Warrior. Make your preparations. When you're ready, come find me at my last vigil. The Dragonborn DLC's Mirak has also been reworked. He can await my arrival with the rest of Tamriel. Sovngarde's son has become more ethereal. When you are ready to rejoin the living, just bid me so, and I will send you back. And Dawnguard's arch curate Vertha sounds more menacing. Look into my eyes, Serana. You tell me what I am. Some more interesting characters include Harkon, who now has a regular voice. The prophesied time. Is at last upon us. And Vampire Lord. And you. This is the power that I offer. Make your choice. A similar effect has been given to Sinding. He has a deeper, more fitting voice. I know now that I can't live among people. But if you spare me, I can be a powerful ally to you. And I would promise to never return to civilized life. There has also been enhancements to Parthenax. Just because you can do a thing does not always mean you should. And also Odaving when conversed. No doubt you want to know where to find Alduin. Dernavir has been reworked too. Simply speak my name to the heavens when you feel the time is right. And finally, the big bad Alduin himself. Each of these changes to these NPCs' voices have been made in order to make them stand out amongst the common rabble, as many have been completely reworked to fit their character and tone better, or just tweak what was already there just to enhance their existing traits or story in a way which really helps make them more enjoyable and fresh to encounter in your game. But you may have noticed a type of unique voice that has been left out of that list. And that's all of the Daedric Princes, which are meant to be literal gods. Sort of. Most of which just have general voices. So we'll start with Meridia, the goddess of light. My beacon is sure to attract a worthy soul. Clavicus Vile, the child god of the Morning Star. As much as I hate to say it, you're almost as powerful as I am right now. Percy, the woodland god of the hunt. Just one glimpse of the glorious star that your kind calls Percy. Mafala, the web spinner. Ah, the blood of deceased is a nourishing flow. Periite, the lord of pestilence. Let these vapors fill your lungs. And Hermaeus Mora, the all knowing. Come closer, bask in my presence. Boethia, the Lord of Deceit. A god, assuredly not. Gods are weak. Our man Sheagorath, Prince of Madness. That's crazy! You don't realize who you're dealing with here. Namira, the Mistress of Decay. Your consumption of the blood and bile of Arke's own is pleasing to me. Vermina, the god of dreams and nightmares. Quickly, kill him now. Kill him and claim his call for your own. Nocturnal, the lady of luck. Farewell, Nightingale. See to it the key stays this time. Maroon's Dagon, the prince of destruction. Sanguine, when in his Daedric form. And you did just that. I haven't been so entertained in at least a hundred years. 
And finally, Molag Ball, the harvester of salt. The mace of Molag Ball. I give you its true power, mortal. And that's going to be everything for this video. If you've enjoyed, drop a like and subscribe, join the Discord server, link is in the description, and I'll see you next time. Take care.